Welcome to this old house. Give muddy, salt-stained floors the boot with this clever stand. Ours gets a stylish upgrade from turned wood stair balusters. First, figure out how tall your boot rack should be. Use a boot as your guide to determine where to cut the balusters. We sized ours to leave about 8 inches of baluster showing with an adult-sized boot. Trim the tops and then cut the bases at a 10 degree angle. On the bottom of each baluster, draw an X connecting the corners. Drill a quarter inch pilot hole one and a half inches deep where the lines intersect. Next, make the base. Detail the ends of the base by cutting each at a 45 degree angle, then snubbing off the pointed ends with a straight cut. Use a combination square to find the center line of the base. Then, lay out your balusters. We use the bottom of one of the balusters to set the spacing. Each one is one and a quarter inches square. We came in two and a half inches from the end and left a one and a quarter inch space between each baluster. We made ours long enough for four pairs of boots. Find and mark the center of each baluster space. Using your marks as a guide, drill holes in the base with the quarter inch bit. You'll need to countersink the baluster lag screws where the feet will attach to the base. To do this, use a 3 8 inch paddle bit to recess and widen the pilot holes on the underside. Using a socket wrench, tighten the lag screws through the bottom of the base into the balusters. To make the feet, miter and snub the ends of a 2x4 similar to the base. Using the drill driver, screw the feet to the base with 2 and a half inch deck screws. Finish attaching the rest of the balusters, alternating the angle of each one to stagger the boots. Prime, paint, and give it a place of honor near your door.